I'd like to tell you the story of this Loon family I photographed in the interior of Algonquin Provincial Park. It's truly a story of the two sides of the wilderness, the beautiful and the harsh. Using my images, my footage, and my voice, I hope to bring you along with me on this photographic journey. It started with an early morning put-in, and through a series of lakes, rivers, and portages, I made my way to the lake where I intended to set up camp. After only a short amount of time exploring the lake, I found a beautiful loon family to photograph, and I really enjoyed the time I spent photographing the young ones as they played together, and as they climbed on their parents' backs, even though they were pretty big at this point. I was also lucky enough to photograph this great blue heron as it fished along the riverbank, and this belted kingfisher as it hunted crayfish in the rocky shallows. I was very happy with this portrait of a bald eagle I got perched on a branch low over the water. After spending some time photographing, I returned to my campsite where I enjoyed some beach time, cut some firewood, and made dinner. As golden hour approached, I got in my canoe and made my way over to a place I'd seen a bald eagle land numerous times. And sure enough, I found it, on the perfect branch, with the perfect light. And as I watched it, it leapt from the branch and with a few strong flaps of its wings, it covered a great distance and dove into the water. And as it powerfully rose out of the water, I could see something in its talons. And that's when I realized it could be one of the baby loons. Using its beak to reposition its prey, it flew higher and higher into the sky. It turned towards the setting light and flew to a distant treetop to enjoy its meal. After photographing that experience, I went back to my campsite, enjoyed a sunset, a warm fire, and I went to bed promising myself that I would go find the Loon family in the morning, and hopefully two chicks. It didn't take me long to find them in the morning, and the light was perfect, and the lake was silky smooth, and I was able to capture these beautiful images of one parent, of the second parent, but unfortunately my suspicions from the night before were confirmed when they only had one chick with them. And I watched them all morning as they dove, time after time coming up with minnows to feed to the chick, until it was no longer hungry enough to accept them anymore. And it was almost as if the parents hadn't adjusted yet, not realizing they wouldn't have to hunt quite so much. that's the story of the Loon family that was four, but is now three. If you like this short video, I hope I can convince you to click that subscribe button. Soon I'll be releasing a three-part series where I backcountry canoe trip in order to film and photograph the moose rut. What you can expect from my channel is wildlife photography, backcountry tripping, and all things wilderness. I hope you'll check out some of my future videos. Have a great day, everyone.